so the uh, injuries, we've got Isang will be out, Caden's out, Cam's out, Tyree will be out, Baron Browning will be out, and then Mike, Russell, Josie, and K1 all practice full today. And barring any setbacks, uh, you know, we're hoping to see Russell out there. Correct. There was no limitations. Very much. Very much. We want to see him get out there and be successful. Oh, the urgency is always there. doesn't matter whether you won last week, lost last week. It's always continuously going to be urgent. Yeah, it's a combination of a lot of things. I think the guys are fired up to get out there and have another opportunity. I think they want to go out there and they want to prove themselves. We've been so close for so many games. It's just been a couple plays here and there, and uh, they want to go out there and make those plays. Hey, do you hope that this has been kind of a, a good break of getting away from the noise to help galvanize this team a little bit? Have you felt that? Of course. No, I, 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 I really believe that. It, it's fun to be in the same hotel. It's almost like training camp again, uh, seeing the guys sit and eat together. Uh, just be around each other more. So I think anytime you get that opportunity, it's great. Coach, just while the Lions come back, would typically the team's coming closer to being close in this sort of explosive time. Is this deliberate on your part to have a much longer time in London? Uh, funny, we actually had talked about this pre, uh, before the season even started. We wanted to have this opportunity. We knew that kind of halfway point, wherever we were, we knew that we wanted to kind of get together, have some team bonding opportunities. It just ended up that <laughs> we really needed it. <laughs> Hey, Russell's always going to think he can go. I mean, that, that's what you love about the guy. He's always going to want to be out there. He's a true competitor. Uh, for us, we wanted to be sure we gave him time, time to be able to uh, get his mind right, his body right, everything. And uh, so just being out here, watching him throw, watching him move in the pocket, uh, you felt a lot more comfortable than, than last week. Very tough. I mean, I mean he, he's he's great. I mean, he wants to be out there for the team. I mean, that, that's what he's about. And um, to not be able to do that for him, that, that, that was hard. And uh, he's willing to do anything to get out on the field. And sometimes as a coach, you have to make those hard decisions. Was there a loss because of the bye next week that might have given you pain? <laughs> yes and no. Uh, when you talk to Russ and mention that, uh, it's, it's not great uh, discussion. Uh, but, I mean, in the end, if he can go, we want him to be able to play. Just focusing on those basics and those fundamentals. I think that's what we did great in that beginning. He was able to get some completions early. Uh, and I, th I think he's had a bunch of them in a row. I think it was about nine or ten in a row to a bunch of different guys. And uh, we just want to continue that. We want to spread the ball around. We want to be efficient and uh, take the shots when we can take them. Uh, he's definitely an option. Uh, I, I think, you know, Devine has done a great job also. He's a guy that, w that we're interested in potentially uh, ha activating for the game. And uh, we're lucky we've got four guys that we think can go out there and play. Especially for the Blake Bailey and Steve Cassidy character. <laughs> I mean, I know you've dealt with injuries a lot. Yeah. But running back specifically, what has that process been? Uh, yeah, I mean, it, like you said, it's been a lot of different positions. There's been uh, a lot of fluidity uh, there. And uh, that's, that's a great challenge for all of us. We're excited for the opportunity that it presents for these guys to go out there and play. Uh, but uh, you, you want some consistency. But, uh, I mean, heck, they got to get out there and ready to go. And uh, it's a challenge for us all. But those guys have all stepped up to it. You've had a number of games in the national spotlight. Now you're in the international spotlight. Can you say what you mean to them? What does it mean to get a win here? Yeah, I mean, it, we just want to win the football game. doesn't matter what spotlight we're in right now. Uh, we want to go out, out there, execute as a team, and play at a high level. Uh, in this situation for us, especially before a bye, it would be great to get a win. It's going to be a heck of a challenge. Jacksonville is a very good football team, and uh, it's going to take all of us. Coach, how did the play calls affect the scheme to rush after the limitations of the week this past week? Uh, I mean, not, not much. Uh, I mean, we're always trying to make it so we can get the ball out, stay in the pocket, things like that. Um, so I think that for us, you know, we built a game plan around him uh, for this week to be able to be creative and do different things, to be able to protect him and at the same time uh, take advantage of different things the defense might give us. But um, regardless, it's going to take all of us to be able to get after this team because they're a really good football team. Right now, that's what it's trending towards. So Calvin will be in there at left, and, and like you said, we'll have Billy at right. And then, uh, so that'll be, uh, we, we've had that starting lineup before, so it'll be good to have, have a game with the same starting lineup. <laughs> we have, we've, had, we've had a good, good, good mix there. Thank you very much. All right, y'all, thank you.